Hello guys, welcome back. Uh, so, I was ready right now to get into Mr. Robert, episode 4. I was going to react to it, I'm doing reaction videos on Patreon for that. Um, and I saw a tweet uh, saying that there is a deleted scenes, a Stambers deleted scenes, uh, from none other episode than the breakup episode. Why did the Supergirl producers, writer, PR team thought that this was a good idea in a good way to promote that fucking DVD Blu-ray shit? I have no idea. But yet, we have it here. You guys know that I I am a Sambers, a Sambers fan. I love them. I, didn't th uh, I, I don't think they did them justice. But I'm also not the type of person who... Holds up, is holding up hopes for them to get back together. Uh, I am not a hopeful person, you might say. I don't know. Uh, I, I do know a few things about Alex's new love life or lack of for season four. I don't know. I know a few things. I am not upset about that. I want Alex to be happy. But who the fuck thought that this was a good idea to promote the DVD? Like, I'm guessing that, you know, there is there is this thing about uh, there is no bad publicity. You're reaching. <laughs> I just, I feel like they are reaching with this shit. But either way, uh, I'm going to react to it because I said, you know what? I miss uh, Supergirl. And I miss ranting about Supergirl. I, I Also, I love Sambers. Why did they decide to do this? Like, I could go easily without watching a scene like this. Like, Kyler has said that there's, like, an episode worth of their scenes. So I'm guessing that there are better scenes than this one that got caught off of the episode because God knows that we needed more of whatever shit they did every single week. Anyways, we needed more of lames. Like, they cut it so we can have more lames. Like... I don't know. But the thing is, I'm going to watch it. I'm going to get traumatized by it, I'm guessing. And yeah, anyways, I'm going to leave you guys the link to the deleted scene on the comment section down below. Uh, also, if you want to watch and buy the DVD, like, <laughs> do it if you want. But like, why? Okay, here we go. Yes, I know it's less than 30 days. This can't be the first wedding you've had canceled. Oh, shit. Making that call. <laughs> You do realize this is the worst day of my life. Oh my god. Sure, you can put it back on the credit card. Which one do you have? Yeah, go ahead and put it on that. And oh we'll my god. Thank you. Oh my god, Maggie! I hate this. I hate this. I hate this. There was, like, I have always said this, and go back to my reactions if you want to, but there was no reason, if they knew they were gonna break them up, there was no reason for them to pursue the wedding. This made it even worse. They could have a long engagement, and then break up. <sighs> I'm so stressed. <sighs> okay, continue. Good news is, Imelda from the wedding venue hopes that you're not dead or haven't turned straight. So oh my two two. god. The bad news is we can only get a quarter of the deposit back and they have my credit card. So um, I can write a check or go to the bank. Or... I don't care about the money. You know that. Oh god. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, oh god. So, um, what are the rules about keeping wedding presents? Oh my um, god. This is so awful. Not really sure. Well, do you think your great uncle Jerry would miss this bottle of tequila? Because I don't want to do this sober anymore. Oh my God, Maggie! Never met him. I think we're good. Oh my God, sweetheart! Right from the bottle. Oh, it's good. Oh my God, Maggie! I fucking hate this. <gasps> oh God! I just want to say I fucking hate this. I just, I hate this. It just makes me even more sad. Yes, I know. I want to traumatize myself again. This can't be the first wedding you've had canceled. You do realize this is the worst day of my life. 
sure, you can. Oh God, I hate this, and he, I hate that he feels like Alex doesn't even give a shit. Uh, like I know she does. I know. Don't get me wrong. I know she does. I know that she. You know, they were incompatible. I guess, I, but there was no reason for them to do this to Maggie. Okay, because after all, after everything, you know, Alex had. Kara and the team and everyone and we never saw anything from Maggie because she just disappeared from the face of the earth like yes you have a few messages with her uh, uh, asking for her passport and just like even when Kara got beat up by Rain the fact that they never even say that Maggie called her like it's stupid oh, I feel so stressed right now why am I watching this again yeah, we go ahead and put it on that, and we'll figure it out. Thank you. Oh Good news is Imelda from the wedding venue hopes that you're not dead or haven't turned straight. I'm two for two. Bad news is we can only get a quarter of the deposit back and they have my credit card. So um, I can write a check or go to the bank. Or... I don't care about the money. You know that. That is the least important part on this. <sighs> so, um... What are the rules about keeping wedding presents? She's trying to pull um, a straight face, like try to be strong really sure. for the both of them. Well, do you think your great uncle Jerry would miss this bottle of tequila? Cause I don't want to do this sober anymore. Never met him. I think we're good. This is so fucking sad. It's so fucking sad. Oh my gosh, she went with it. I hate that. Guess who's not buying this shit? Me. Fuck off. Anyways, guys. <sighs> I just, I wish that, you know, there's nothing. I, I feel that there's nothing we can do about Sambers anymore. I, I just call me a pessimist, whatever. I, I just, I, I, I. I I, I don't know. I don't know if I want to go back there. I, I honestly don't know. I don't think Floriana will ever come back. I'm the pessimist in this situation, okay? Uh, but the thing is, um, I just wish that Alex's, Alex's love life, the next time we see it, I mean, it could have been so easy to put Alex with, with, with Sam. It will be so easy, but I'm guessing, you know, the actress had other commitments or I don't know. But whoever enters Alex's life, God, I wish that they give them the time to develop their relationship, to not make it feel like everything is perfect. Because Sambers, until a point before the whole kids thing, they were too perfect working. Yes, they were mature enough to work their problems and all of that. But they never give them room to to be anything else. I just hope that whoever gets into the storyline is not just Alex's love interest. Because sadly, Maggie was just Alex's love interest. And that 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 is why it was so easy to write her off. And not have anyone remember about Maggie, you know? It was so easy because she was never... A, an important part of this story like she was there to serve a pur purpose which was being alex's love interest we have a we had a beautiful coming out with alex yes granted no one is gonna take that away from it from us and sambers will always be an important relationship even if they are not in game even if they are not together at the moment that doesn't mean that all the beautiful things that came with sambers are not real you know, in my case, you know, I'm ready to get into the next thing. And I hope that, you know, they give this next person, uh, this next girl, the chance to be an important part of the storyline. Uh, so that person is not just Alex's love interest, but it's so much more, you know. I think that we deserve that. I mean, they are doing it with Winona Earp. It's it's not that difficult. It's not rocket science. It's easy to do it if you actually care about your characters, you know? 
Uh, but if you don't, then, you know, I'm guessing that you will continue doing the same things that they did with Sambers. But it's, it's, it's only fair that the next person will be something more important. That it's not as easy to write her off this show, you know. Um, but yeah, I mean, if you're holding up hopes for Sambers, this doesn't mean that what I'm saying is the ultimate truth. You know, truth, it's not. If you're holding on hopes for for Sambers, you're in every right to do so and to continue shipping them, to continue wanting for an endgame for them. I am more of a pessimist, like I said. I, I don't think they will come back. I, I, I if if they come back, if, if, she, if Maggie comes back, of course I will root for a Sambers endgame. But... At the moment, I don't. I'm not feeling hopeful that she will come back. I don't know if she will. If she was going to come back, we will have known already, you know. Uh, but I don't think she will. Uh, but I, I really hope that um, Alex finds happiness and find what she's looking for, and you know, because she deserves to be happy. I think we can all agree that she does deserve to be happy. So. Yeah, that's it. I'm not going to keep ranting. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this reaction video. Give it a thumbs up still if you love Sambers. And that's it. I'll see you guys next time for more reaction videos for Supergirl. Mwah. Bye, guys.